My name is Paula Wills and I'm happy to welcome you to another episode of FRCD on CAN TV where we focus on special education, parent advocacy, and resources for families of children with disabilities. And today I am happy to introduce, introduce Tracy Schultz from the Epilepsy Foundation of Greater Chicago to our show today. Hi Tracy, how are you? I'm good Paula, how are you? I am good. <laughs> <laughs> almost forgot to answer that question there. Um, so could you tell us about the Epilepsy Foundation for Greater Chicago and how it helps families? For sure. So the mission of the foundation here in Chicago is to lead the fight to stop seizures and to find a cure and overcome challenges that people with epilepsy face on a daily basis. And our services are wide ranging. Um, here in the Chicago office, uh, we offer all of our services free of charge to the families. And they range from counseling, advocacy, and educational services um, to more specific programming for different subsets of populations. So for example, um, and I think Paula's pulling it up there, for parents specifically, um, we have support groups. We have educational advocacy services, which basically means that we can have a counselor or a case manager come on out to your child's school to advocate on your child's behalf uh, for a 504 or an IEP meeting. Uh, we also have school-based educational programs, which is my area of expertise in the office. So we provide on-site uh, school training programs for staff, for school nurses, and also for students in grades K through 12 and beyond. So we can do age-appropriate training on seizure recognition and first aid for students, and then again, as well as staff. Uh, we also have, if you saw the flashing through there, our Parent Link program. And our Parent Link program focuses on topics that are important to parents, so things that they want more information about. So for example, our current series that's running, uh, we did series on depression and epilepsy. We did a session on sibling issues and epilepsy. We also will be talking about 504 and IEP planning, and um, we talked about transition planning, so getting your child into high school and then beyond high school, what will happen. Um, we have our Consumer Conference, which is an annual event that we host free of charge again to families, people with epilepsy. And it's an all day educational session on different topics that pertain to epilepsy, like treatment, um, anxiety, depression, um, medical services, insurance questions, um, just space time with a doctor so you can sit and ask questions that you have that you may have not asked your treating physician. And so there's a lot of programs available for the parents to take advantage of, but then we also have programs for the kids that um, benefit the parents. So first and foremost is our Camp Blackhawk program. So it's a week-long summer camp experience. So it's a chance for a child with epilepsy to basically go away to summer camp. They spend you know, five nights out of the house sleeping in a cabin with other kids who have epilepsy and they go swimming, they play sports, they go play archery, they do a zip line, all kinds of activities. So things that you would normally do at an overnight summer camp that, you know, is in a medically safe environment. So we have nursing on staff 24 seven and the counselors work with them based on a ratio of care, no more than three campers to every one counselor. So it's a chance for the parents to have a week away to themselves to do something or even have a week to spend with their other children that they may not get to concentrate on all the time. And then we have other programs like art therapy, writing therapy, we have our teen group program. Um, so there's a lot to take advantage of in the office. And so our website is the best place to access that information at uh, www.epilepsychicago.org.